From the Bob Mills Weather Center, meteorologist Andrew Adams. It's been a nice start to the month so far. We've seen over an inch of rain here in Oklahoma City out at Will Rogers World Airport. That puts us uh, about three-tenths of an inch over where we ought to be this time of the month. So that's a great start. No snow so far. I'm okay with that. I think everyone is. Snow always makes things a mess, even though it can be fun sometimes. And here's our next cold front. It's already trying to push into the panhandle this morning, and it will make things quite a bit colder as we go into tomorrow. But ahead of that cold front, very warm this afternoon. 70s and 80s, we'll see some storms in eastern Oklahoma, or at least the chance for some storms, maybe a few sprinkles here late tonight and into early, early tomorrow morning before things really cool down. Tomorrow afternoon, Monday afternoon, even into Tuesday afternoon, a little bit below average, and then we warm back up. It's that time of year. We're going to see temperature swings on the nine day quite a lot. So warmer again by the time we get to Wednesday afternoon and then Thursday. Next cold front arrives. That brings in the chance for more showers and thunderstorms, maybe even a little taste of winter to portions of the state. And it cools us down even more than today's cold front for the end of next week. As you look into the upper Midwest and the high plains and a big ball of Arctic air starts to drift down, we don't get the coldest of it, but we will see a uh, chilly air takeover at the end of the nine day and then look toward the west by next Saturday through Monday for maybe some timing on our next storm system. This one, though, has been all over the place on the models. The one that we've been watching for today, it's an eastern Oklahoma concern. We'll be dry here across central Oklahoma until late tonight. Here's 7 o'clock in the evening. Showers and thunderstorms liable to pop up here in eastern and southeastern Oklahoma. They've got much more instability there than we do. And also, there we go. Some showers off in western Oklahoma. Those drift into central Oklahoma well after sunset. So if you are going out tonight, don't be surprised if we do have a few showers that make its way through. It's not going to be anything severe, but something to make the ground a little wet likely won't add up to a whole lot at uh, Will Rogers for official rain total purposes, but will be something that we can notice when it does fall and then dry for tomorrow. This morning, it's quiet on our Lucky Star Sky Cam network, but also a bit shaky on the roof cam right now. 60 degrees, very, very warm. South wind sustained at 16 miles per hour. We've seen gusts much higher than that already this morning. Temperatures across central Oklahoma, low 60s, upper 50s to the north. Those 40s in northwest Oklahoma, there's continuing to uh, fizzle out as that south breeze continues to really crank. 15 to 30 miles per hour gusting right now here in central Oklahoma. There's a gust of 31 out in El Reno right now. We will see the winds hang around as we go through this afternoon. 79 here, Oklahoma City, 80s to the west and southwest Oklahoma, mid 80s likely there. Up to the north, even behind the cold front, would not be surprised before it really presses through to see some 70s to upper 60s. So everyone pretty nice and comfortable today. Some light drizzle and showers late this evening and into the overnight for central and northwest Oklahoma. These 40 and 60 percent chances of rain and thunderstorms, that's mainly in the evening hours tonight and then will dry out. And some of those thunderstorms in far eastern and southeastern Oklahoma, should they develop, could be on the low end severe, maybe some quarter size hail and 60 mile per hour wind gusts. Much chillier tomorrow morning compared to this morning, though right at average for us. 38 here in Oklahoma City. Some of us only getting down to just about 40, but everyone much cooler tomorrow afternoon. Highs, they fall back into the mid 50s. So cooler air is back and it will be with us for the next couple of afternoons as we spring forward overnight tonight. Roller coaster back up 71 Wednesday back to that chilly air mass next weekend. Tevis.